Oh my gosh, this is so good. If you love to sing, but you don't like the sound of your voice, I want to let you know that you are in the right place. When I first started, I had a terrible singing voice. I've told this story before, but I remember the first cover I ever posted on social media. I was so excited about it. I look at the comments and all the comments are like, do not ever sing again, please. I was so embarrassed, but it wasn't until I met a professional singer at the time who became my mentor. He showed me some secrets and he showed me some techniques and exercises that changed everything for me and these were things that I hadn't heard before which shocked me as well. If we fast forward now I'm a professional singer and I've been able to teach thousands of people in over 100 countries how to sing and a lot of these people were like me where they were feeling a bit discouraged and feeling like you know they didn't have what it takes to be a singer. But I want to prove this to you because I know that anybody can come on here and say anything so I made a free 10 minute singing lesson. I link it in every video so you can't miss it. It's in the description in the top comment. If you record your voice before that lesson and then you go through it and you record your voice after, when you compare those two audios, I believe you're going to be shocked. But even if you just hear a slight, a tiny improvement in your voice, then you gotta know that you have what it takes to become an amazing singer. We believe in you here. You can do this. You will succeed at singing. This is something that you can do. And I just want you to realize that you are no different than any of us or anybody who we are about to react to. Singing is something that you can do when you have the right secrets, when you have the right exercises, when you have the right knowledge, which is exactly what changed everything for me. So hopefully I can be that for you and I can show you that uh, this dream is worth pursuing. Good for this, but we're in this together. Are you ready? Let's do this. Make sure that you leave me a comment too. Tell me what you thought about this performance after my reaction. All right, let's do it. Oh my gosh, here we go. Cheers. Oh my. I'm about to be in tears by the end of this. place right now you know feeling that oh my gosh look at that oh my gosh do you hear that did you hear that in her voice that little cry in her voice okay oh this is so good here's the thing that you got to realize too a lot of this isn't just about the voice and what she can do with her voice. All right, there's a law called the law of emotional transference, which means as a performer or as a speaker right now to you who is speaking through a camera or even in your communication with your friends, okay, whatever you are feeling deep down, the other person can't help but feel a little bit of that emotion. 
All right, you'll notice this if you if you go into anybody if you if you visit a friend who is even just a little bit in tune emotionally and you're feeling down, they're gonna pick up on it and they're gonna be like, "What's wrong? You okay?" All right. If you go and you're smiling, you're happy, they're gonna be like, "What's going on? Why are you so happy?" Well, the same thing happens, but at an even larger degree when you're performing on a stage, she is thinking of a memory, okay, that is congruent with that song. She's thinking of that sad memory, okay, of maybe like a loved one that she had lost or something. And she's thinking about it as she's singing. She's not thinking about her voice. She's not being self-critical. And that is why it is connecting so deep with the audience and you'll see people move to tears. You'll see me moved live right now watching this together. But does she have an amazing voice? Yes. But is that why we're so moved? No, it's not. It's that law of emotional transference. And that's something that every singer needs to master, especially if they want to get into performing. She's doing such a good job. This is incredible. She's so invested in this performance. Look at her. Wow. You see what I'm saying? And that's what's, that's what's hitting people here. They can't even help it. Oh my gosh, she is a performer. Look at that. Oh my gosh, this is so good. Oh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I like this. I didn't even like the original song, to be honest. I like this. This is not the, I like this. That's what? I love this. This is incredible. <laughs> Oh my gosh, the emotion, like, again, you can just feel it. She's a master performer. That's what it's all about. She's making us feel something. And that's why we're so captivated. And that is why this went viral. And I wouldn't even doubt if she won this whole singing competition because every performance that I've seen of her, she is invested emotionally because she realizes that to be a good performer, to be a good singer, this is not just about singing. Okay, it's also about that metaphysical. It's about the performing. It's about your energy and connecting with other people. And that's emotional. Again, you. Right, and an amazing use of dynamics. Oh my gosh. I'm like, yeah. Come on. Now that reminded me of Jesse J, who we just saw. Oh my gosh. Take a sip of coffee to that. Cheers. Mm. All right, I gotta know what you thought about that. Leave a comment down below, share your opinion.